everyone has a spot in your yard that you want to see fill in quicker so i want to give you a few tips uh, today about how to get grass warm season grass which is what we have here in mississippi we don't have the cool season grass uh, like fescue bluegrass up north where they depend on seeding but uh, bermuda grass centipede st augustine so forth um, how do we get that to fill in quicker how do we get this bare spot to not be a bare spot that's not as simple of a uh, you know it, that can be a complex answer but what i can tell you is that mowing frequency affects that the more frequent you mow the more grass grows horizontally as opposed to vertically i have this ugly looking grass here beside me to show you what happens if you don't mow at all this has not been mowed all year and so the grass this is bermuda grass it's just grown straight up it's not trying to go sideways you can look down and you can see every square inch of dirt right there because it's not a thick canopy of grass because all the growth has been vertical it's not tried to go horizontal so if you if you mow more frequently and that's the best i can tell you you don't want to really quantify like this many times or this many uh, times per week uh, because every yard is different everybody's budget is different but just know the concept is the more frequent the better and if you want it to fill in quicker mow more often consider even twice a week if you really have a certain area even if you just go out and just mow that one area to see if that can help and you have to be patient it's going to take several weeks for it but you're going to notice it's going to start going this way quicker obviously it could be water it could be sunlight it could be fertilizer it could be compaction it could be those things and we have videos on all those things check out the uh, barrel illustration video we have on watering that not only talks about watering, but how all the different factors affect growth and your most limiting factor is what really affects your growth the most. But don't let mowing frequency be the thing that causes your grass to be more vertical in growth. Like we don't have this yard right here mowed, but once every two, sometimes even three weeks. And so you can still see the ground. It's not a dense canopy. This spot is being really slow to fill in. You can see the runners running across the ground. Um, but the more you do it, the more it's going to fill in, the quicker it's going to fill in. Again, uh, check out our other videos for how, uh, you know, if something's on the north side of, a, of an object, then your sunlight's going to be limiting the growth. Uh, your mowing height, if you really mow it low in the drought, in a droughted time where we're not getting much rain, that's going to low, uh, slow your growth. So you might want to even consider bringing your mowing height up during a drought. Otherwise, Bermuda likes it mowed as low as possible. Um, fertilizer obviously uh, but if you have any questions about mowing frequency let us know uh, and the more the better I'll say centipede is a lazy man's grass it does really well at once every two weeks but if you have a certain area of your centipede and you want it to grow in faster just consider bumping that up to maybe once a week or uh, whatever you're able to do so hope that helps thank you for listening hope you have a good day